Ice predicted deep freeze could force the city to comply with the governor's new executive order to insist the homeless go to shelters when the mercury dips. Governor Cuomo is vowing to force the city to make shelters safe and hospitable. CBS2 political reporter Marsha Kramer joins us now with the very latest on this. Marsha? Well, Chris and Christine, it's a conundrum. Both the governor and the mayor say that for their own good, the homeless should not be on the street when it's cold outside. But many on the street tell us they'd rather freeze than go to a shelter. It's not safe. The shelters are dirty, they say. Cuomo says he intends to step in to help fix that. The shelters can be dangerous. There's criminals in there. Luis Diaz and his wife Jennifer, homeless and begging in Midtown, say they won't be dragged into a shelter tonight, no matter how cold it gets, no matter what Governor Cuomo or Mayor de Blasio says. Well, I wouldn't go. I'll try tonight for them not to find me. I'll, I'll try to hide somewhere. Apparently, Governor Cuomo has heard that a lot since he signed an executive order yesterday to force the city to move the street homeless into shelters when the temperature dips below freezing. I've spoken to a lawyer for the homeless this morning who said, look, the right decision is not to go because it's better from their point of view uh, and safer to stay on a train or in a subway station where it's warm because the shelters are more dangerous. Governor, if New York City shelters are dirty and unsafe, what can you as governor do about it? If shelters are not up to code, uh, then we are going to be very diligent in our inspection uh, and management of the existing shelter system. Como also said he will seek ideas for fixing city shelters from controller Scott Stringer. Stringer released a report recently finding deplorable conditions in some shelters. Stringer said he would be glad to participate, adding, quote, the homeless crisis in our city demands all hands on deck. My audit of the Department of Homeless Services found children and families living in unsafe shelter units infested with rodents and vermin. Meanwhile, Mayor de Blasio said the city didn't need the governor's executive order. The city already has a code blue policy of bringing the homeless in when it's cold. If someone's in danger, we will bring them in, period. We'll use force if necessary. We have used it for years. That's the point. Well, I asked the governor for details about how he plans to improve the city's shelter system. He said he would unveil his plans next week in Albany during his State of the State speech. Meanwhile, the city says it's been systematically fixing shelter problems. More than 12,000 building violations have already been fixed, and work has begun on long-term repairs. Chris, Christine. Marcia, thank you. Marcia. And many of these shelters are close to capacity, so where will the people living on the street go? That part of the story is coming up tonight at 6 o'clock.